Acquisitions and capital, these two things are absolutely tied. So in 2023, we bought 132 properties. For years and years, we have continued to stockpile, putting ourselves in a position of strength so that we could be choosy when it came to which properties we wanted to acquire. Well, that's the way that we have been operating in 2022, as well as 2023. And now in 2024, you're continuing to see that. So we'll only be buying about 60 in 2024. We have those 60 are largely just based on our relationships here locally. But those relationships are invaluable. It's really an investment in our relationships locally because we're in such a position of strength. When it comes to private lending dollars, this is a key source of capital for JWB. So how do you buy thousands of lots that you sit on and how do you build out 440 in a year? Well, a lot of that comes from our lenders, our private lenders, which a lot of you are private lenders. You basically lend on projects that JWB develops either into brand new construction homes or other types of projects. And that's what our private lending program is. Private lending in 2023 raised over over $29 million. So again, another thing that we don't shed a lot of light on here. Oh, by the way, our private lending team just raised just about 30 million bucks in a year. Big shout out to the team there. And then in 2024, we'll be raising 24 million. That's our goal. And the only reason that number comes down is because you can see the properties purchased will come down. If you purchase less properties, then you need less capital to be raised from private lending. Sounds good, man.